To the President, Board of Directors, Deans and Faculty, we salute you and thank you for a great journey. To the alumni, parents, family and friends, we honor you and thank you for your love and support without which today would have been impossible. And I thank God for getting us to this day that we will forever share. Now, to the class of 2017, I want you to congratulate yourselves. So please turn to the person on your right and say, you rock. Now turn to the person on your left and say, I rock. I love the theme that was selected for this commencement ceremony. It actually conveys to us how we should see ourselves in light of what we have accomplished as fellow graduates. So allow me for the next few minutes to reflect upon the idea of education as a foundational bedrock and a redemptive tool. What do I mean by education as, a redemp as redemption? The word redemption has two basic meanings. Number one, there is a spiritual meaning. It speaks to the action of saving or being saved from ignorance, error, or evil. Number two, there is a social and economic meaning. It speaks to the action of regaining or gaining possession of something in exchange for payment or clearing a debt. Education is a tool that takes a person through a process of personal elevation and is capable of dispelling ignorance or erroneous or sometimes harmful or dangerous ideas. Education is a tool that can elevate an individual out of poverty and propel them into new and meaningful social connections. The greatest and most important investment an individual, a family, a state, or a nation can make in its people is the education of its people. Access to quality higher education makes true to the idea that where you start in life does not have to be where you finish. I was born in a little town called Newcastle in the province of Puerto Limon in Costa Rica, Central America. I was the fifth child of seven children. In that little town, at the time, educational possibilities only went as far as the sixth grade. Life in that little town was hard, and uh, prospects of socioeconomic mobilizations were all, almost non-existent. But because my mother, the rock of the family, was a strong believer in the redemptive power of education, she was instrumental in convincing my father that the family should move to a city where educational opportunities were more readily accessible for her children. In our home, it was constantly drilled in us that education is a foundation on which to anchor the journey of success and endless possibilities in one's life. Every human being is born in this world with potential. Education actuates that potential. Actuated potential creates better societies and makes stronger nations. One of the greatest tragedies in this life is wasted potential. But one of the greatest blessings in this life is to see potentials realized and dreams achieved. When I graduated high school 
My parents could not afford to financially support me with all that was required. They gave me all that they could afford, and it was on me to make up the difference. Two of my hometown buddies uh, and I, uh, we came together and we made a pledge that no matter what, all three of us would graduate from college. We decided to work in door-to-door -door book sales in order to earn money to cover our educational expenses. We covenant that all sales were to be divided in three parts. We were determined that we would all succeed or all fail. Even on days when one of us was unable to go out in the field, all sales for that day were divided in three parts. I am happy to report that one of them is a medical doctor in Texas, and the other is a doctor of ophthalmology with a practice in North Carolina. And today, I am graduating as a doctor of psychology. I think that it is very appropriate to say, we rock. Education is redemption. I am standing here today as a living testimony of one who has been redeemed through education. You, my fellow graduate, you are here today because you had a dream to take your life to the next level. This dream propelled you to work hard, believe in yourself, to stay focused, to go with little or no sleep sometimes, to persevere when everything was saying just quit. However, you did not quit because deep down inside of you, you were a believer in the redemptive power of education. So you stayed the course and you completed the task. You have earned the right to say, you rock. Yes, you made it. Yes, we did it. So as we celebrate, remember that to whom much is given, much is required. When you leave this place, go as an agent of redemption. Reach back and pull someone else forward so that when we come to the sunset of our days, we may be able to reflect on our lives and say that we realized our potential. We realized our dreams and we laid a foundation, a bedrock for generations that follow. Therefore, I rock, you rock, we rock now. Rock on!